Hi guys, my name is Jana Kunitz. I'm creative director at Body FX. Over the years, I have seen thousands and thousands of before and after photos, and some of them been really great, and some of them have not been that good. So today, I'm here to share with you how to take those perfect before and after photos. If you're wondering or doubting, should you take before and after photos? I would say yes, yes, yes. I want you to start taking your before and after photos starting today and then every four weeks. And the number one reason why to take these photos are because it's the best way to track your results. Even though the scale might not have changed much, Photos can show how much tighter and tone you have become since your starting day. Photos are also incredible motivational boosters. When you see how your body changes from one month to the next, you will want to keep going. And when you guys have these great before and after photos, you can join our exciting monthly Body of X challenges and have a chance to win cash, prizes, and even trips all over the world. And now let's talk about our top tips how to take those before and after photos. Number one, location, location, location. Please use a plain wall or a door. Avoid patterns, bright colors, clutter, or any distracting objects in the background. Also try and use the same spot for all your before and after pictures. Number two, lighting. Take your photos indoors and try to use natural daylight. If you cannot use natural light, ensure that the room is well lit with as much light as possible. Also make sure you're facing towards the lighting. Avoid backlighting, it will ruin the quality of your images. Now tip number three, the camera. Please use the best camera that you will have for the duration of your fitness journey. You can use your own smartphone, but please no mirror selfies. That's a big no-no. Make sure your camera is positioned several feet away from you and that it is capturing your full frame, centered and head to toe. And here is a big one. Make sure you position the camera at eye level. Not too low, not too high. It has to be at your eye level. If you're taking your own photos, you can use the timer setting. 10 seconds is a good amount of time to get into a perfect position and voila! Or you can ask someone that you trust to take the photos for you. Tip number four, clothing. At Body FX, we request that everyone, men and women, wear shorts and a tank top for all the before and after photos. Make sure the tank top is form-fitting so we can see your waistline well. Then if you want to take additional photos where your abs are exposed, ladies, we suggest shorts and a sports bra or a swimsuit. For men, please wear shorts without a shirt. Do not wear any type of underwear or lingerie. Tip number five, wear the same outfit. Try to wear the same outfit every time you take your pictures. As you continue to achieve your fitness goals with body effects, you might find that your start day clothing no longer fits. If this happens, no worries, just wear something very similar, the same color and shape, but in a smaller size. Avoid posing in oversized clothing. You'll want to see your shape and progress. Tip number six, poses. For your poses, we require six angles. One, full body front, head to toe, arms straight down to your sides and slightly away from the body. Two, full body back, arms straight down to your sides and slightly away from the body. Three, side profile right, arms straight down to your sides, palms gently resting on outer thighs. Four, side profile left, arms straight down to your sides, palms gently resting on outer thighs. Five, the quarter turn right. Start facing the camera and make a quarter turn. Then turn your shoulders parallel towards the camera. Place your hands on the hips and bend your front knee slightly. Men, when you do the same quarter turn, keep your feet flat on the floor, knee straight and lift your ribcage up. Six, the quarter turn left. Start facing the camera and make a quarter turn. Remember again, shoulders parallel towards the camera, hands on your hips and bend your front knee slightly. And don't forget to smile. These poses are vital to do during and after your weight loss, not just to see your physical progress, but to also show your confidence. Tip number seven, timing. It's very important to take your photos every four weeks and on the same day each month. A great way to remember to take your photos on time is to participate in our Body Effects monthly challenges. This will be the best way to keep you accountable and track your progress accurately. Tip number eight, how to submit. 
Now, since you have taken your photos, it's time to submit your photos to bodyfxchallenge.com for your chance to win cash, prices, and even trips all over the world. Remember, when sending in your photos, make sure they are original pictures. We cannot accept altered, cropped, or edited pictures. And please, no collages or any type of filters. Keep it all natural. Okay guys, I think that's it. I hope you enjoyed my little tutorial. Now go and take those perfect before and after photos and I cannot wait to see them.